Hi, we're the Rothwells and we're a full-time traveling family from Hawaii. Together we've been to more than 50 countries and hundreds of cities around the world. We love making travel guides of our favorite places to help other families eat, see, and do it all while creating lasting memories together. It's a big, beautiful world out there, so let's do this. Today we'll explore the vibrant and culturally rich city of Melbourne, Australia. From delicious food to fascinating history, Melbourne has it all. So grab your notepad and get ready to discover the top 10 things to do in this incredible city. Melbourne, often referred to as the cultural capital of Australia, boasts a rich history that dates back to its founding in 1835. Named after the British Prime Minister of the time, Lord Melbourne, the city began as a small settlement along the banks of the Yarra River. Its strategic location and access to fertile land quickly transformed Melbourne into a bustling port city during the Victorian gold rush of the 1850s. As wealth flowed into the city, grand architecture and cultural institutions emerged, giving birth to Melbourne's reputation as a hub of art, culture, and innovation. However, Melbourne's history is also intertwined with a friendly rivalry with Sydney, Australia's largest city. The competition between these two urban giants, known as the Sydney-Melbourne rivalry, has deep historical roots. It's a rivalry that spans everything from sports to culture and even a spirited debate over which city holds the title of Australia's true capital. This healthy competition has driven both cities to excel in various fields and has contributed to the unique identities and charms of each. Let's dive into the top 10 things to do in Melbourne. Melbourne's iconic laneways are a testament to the city's vibrant and creative spirit. These charming narrow streets, tucked away amidst the bustling city, are a visual treat. As you wander through them, you'll be greeted by an explosion of street art, murals, and graffiti that add a unique character to Melbourne. Hosier Lane, one of the most famous, is an ever-changing canvas, showcasing the work of talented local and international artists. ACDC Lane pays homage to the legendary rock band, while DeGraves Street is a quaint and bustling alley filled with cozy cafes and boutiques. The laneways are not just picturesque, but also a fantastic spot for some Instagram-worthy photos. Melbourne's Royal Botanic Gardens offer a serene oasis in the heart of the city. Spanning over 38 hectares, these gardens are a sanctuary for nature enthusiasts and a delightful destination for families. As you meander through the well-maintained pathways, you'll encounter an astounding array of plant species, including native Australian flora and exotic plants from around the world. Don't miss the exquisite Guilfoyles Volcano, a stunning water reservoir designed in the shape of a volcano, or the peaceful Fern Gully, where you can spot ancient ferns. Take a break at one of the picnic spots and enjoy a relaxing meal surrounded by the beauty of nature. An iconic Australian meal you've got to try is the humble meat pie, tender beef and gravy encased in pillowy pastry. Smother it in ketchup or tomato sauce, as the locals call it, and you'll find a great lunch for less than $5. Melbourne's rich history comes to life at the Melbourne Museum and Immigration Museum. These captivating institutions are more than just museums, they're time machines that transport you through the ages. The Melbourne Museum is a treasure trove of artifacts, from indigenous cultural displays to the awe-inspiring skeleton gallery. The highlight here is Far Lap, the beloved racehorse whose legend lives on. The Immigration Museum is equally fascinating, shedding light on Australia's multicultural heritage. Interactive exhibits, personal stories, and reconstructed ships give you a glimpse into the immigrant experience. It's an educational and eye-opening visit for families. The Queen Victoria Market is a culinary paradise and a shopper's delight. This bustling market has been a Melbourne institution for over a century. It's the place to immerse yourself in the city's food culture. From fresh produce to gourmet delicacies, you'll find an array of goodies to indulge in. 
be sure to try some of the local treats, like a steaming hot jam donut or a classic Australian sausage roll. The market is also a fantastic spot to shop for unique souvenirs and gifts, making it a must visit for families exploring Melbourne. Melbourne's iconic trams are not just a mode of transport, they're a symbol of the city's history and culture. A tram ride in Melbourne is like a rolling tour of the city's diverse neighborhoods and historic landmarks. Hop on a tram and enjoy the leisurely journey as you pass by landmarks such as Flinders Street Station, the Arts Centre, and the Melbourne Cricket Ground. It's a convenient way to get around the city while soaking in its unique atmosphere. For art lovers, the National Gallery of Victoria is a true gem. The NGV is Australia's oldest and most visited art museum, and it's brimming with masterpieces from around the globe. Explore a vast collection of art spanning centuries, from Renaissance classics to contemporary works. Marvel at iconic pieces by artists like Rembrandt, Monet, and Picasso. The NGV also hosts exciting temporary exhibitions, making each visit a unique experience for families looking to appreciate the world of art. Melbourne Zoo is a fantastic destination for families seeking a fun and educational day out. Spread over 22 hectares, the zoo is home to over 300 species of animals from around the world. Kids and adults alike will be thrilled to see exotic animals like lions, tigers, and elephants up close. There are also interactive exhibits and shows that provide insights into wildlife conservation efforts. It's an opportunity for the whole family to connect with the animal kingdom and learn about the importance of conservation. Melbourne takes its coffee seriously, and it's earned a reputation as one of the coffee capitals of the world. For a true Melbourne experience, you must indulge in its coffee culture. Head to one of the countless local cafes and order a flat white or a cappuccino expertly crafted by skilled baristas. The city's cafes often serve delicious brunch dishes that pair perfectly with your coffee. It's a delightful way to refuel and soak in Melbourne's relaxed atmosphere. St. Kilda Pier is a beautiful and iconic spot that offers stunning views of Port Phillip Bay. Take a leisurely walk along the pier and you'll be rewarded with breathtaking scenery. One of the highlights of the pier is the St. Kilda Breakwater, where you can spot adorable little penguins returning to their nests at sunset. It's a heartwarming sight that will delight visitors of all ages, especially the little ones. Our Melbourne adventure concludes with a visit to the old Melbourne jail, a place that provides a captivating glimpse into Australia's convict history. Explore the eerie cells and corridors of this historic jail, which once housed some of Australia's most notorious criminals. Learn about the harsh conditions and punishments of the time, and hear the stories of inmates who called this place home. It's a history lesson that will leave a lasting impression on visitors young and old. And there you have it, our in-depth exploration of Melbourne's top 10 things to do. From the vibrant laneways to the cultural institutions, there's something for everyone in this incredible city. Whether you're a nature lover, history buff, or foodie, Melbourne truly has it all. Hey guys, thank you so much for watching this video. If you got some value out of it, please give us a thumbs up or let us know in the comments below and we'll see you in the next Family Travel Guide.